February 10th, my second video for today. I just went outside to boil the water in the water container in my new uh, wood stove I built. But northerly wind was blowing too much, so and it got kind of cold, so I brought it in. But this is my wood stove I built, and I made the front to come off. And I have a screen that I got. I got dollar store Betty Crocker drying rack perfect screening. I just got it and cut it to the size I want. Probably cut another one. Co-hanger for a cross to rest it on and a screws at the bottom to hold it together. Uh, hinges on the side. I had tried to glue the hinges. None of the heat would work once I used my uh, penny stove in it or for a trial before I took it out for wood. So I got the... It's, uh, they're there. And uh, it's it's sturdy enough for sure with the extra bolts in the bottom. And then on the front, I took my hinges, took the pins, pin it out. I use a paper clip or I nail the head on it just to work it there. And it gives me the front. And the bottom, I can bottom feed the wood in or on the top. So here I am. Had this outside. Tried one camera. It wouldn't work. The other camera said the disc was full. But it, it's pretty cool. I like it. I like how it's sturdy. It might be a little heavier than I want it. And it seems like it's going to require a lot to set up wherever I go. So that's something I'm going to have to think about. And my bottle here from Dave Canterbury, when I was watching him a lot, right here, spray painted my water bottle. And on the top I have these, which we can get in the tackle shop. And that will lift it up. And uh, let me take it out of the fire. And it's starting to boil now. I noticed that outside I'm burning gasoline antifreeze today for my fuel, which I use in my uh, penny stoves or cat can stoves. It was hard to tell it was burning out there until I burnt some uh, hair on my arm and hand and I knew because you know the smell. But it was hard to see a northerly wind. My windscreen kind of blew away. So I had to use uh, snow, which worked perfectly around it on my table. And uh, I'm quite happy with it. I'm going to use those tie plates, an idea from YouTube, and so it's uh, going to be good. Can't wait to take it on the trail and uh, give it a real go in a real situation. Anyways, going to let this boil, have some coffee, enjoy the day. Have a good one.